are not available now. Please leave your name and phone number mm -hmm. after the beep. How do y'all, they post stuff and then don't pick up the phone. Like, bro, we've been sitting here for almost, we've been sitting here for a whole hour now. We haven't even got in contact with anybody yet to even, even quote us a price. And people don't answer their emails. That's another thing you got to deal with. We're trying to get to the Midwest, so we're not just taking anything. Skeezy on the beat, oh. You know what it is. It's your boy D Stu, and you know we back with another banger. But anyways, today we're gonna be doing this batching. Y'all know we had the crib with it, so y'all enjoy, man. No, no, you can't. Woo now we got our coffee, guys. Now we ready to roll. You know what I'm saying? Burn my lips a little bit, but good, good morning. When I was on the road, I wasn't able to drink coffee because this shit made me poop. <laughs> so, all right, y'all. So, how we start our day off with, as you can see, get you a cup of coffee. After you get you a cup of coffee, you want to call your driver, make sure your driver's up, make sure you're ready to roll. Also, you want to know how much time it's going to take him to get there, which is going to take him about an hour to get from the hotel to the drop-off. Um, we drove about as far as we could last night. And then from there, you pretty much can map out your day. So we know it's going to take him an hour to get there, maybe a little bit like an hour and 30. Then you want, he's going to have to get unloaded. Hopefully, that don't take too long to get unloaded. Hopefully he don't take too long to get unloaded. Um, so about two hour window. So that means we'll have like nine hours left to drive. All right, so that's what we're shooting for. All right, so after you get that information, the first thing you wanna do is check the weather, guys. You must check the weather, all right? See what's good, see what's bad. All right, y'all, let's go to the computer. All right, so as you can see, there is, um, Looks like some rain here in the middle side of the state. And back over here by Utah, Denver, Los Angeles is definitely rain and snow. Looks like a little bit of rain over here. We'll play the radar real quick. See how it flows. Looks like some snow has already been through New York and whatever. We're in Jamaica, New York, so. Or the truck is in Jamaica, New York. Second thing, all right, have your RTS pulled up. We got our RTS pulled up and ready to rock. And our load board. And we actually. Need to refresh it. All right, so we always start with poster truck. We actually got to delete this one. This was yesterday. We got no calls yesterday. So we're actually gonna post a truck. We we're gonna put no destination. Uh, we put the date, the availability, especially. We want full loads, uh, straight box truck, 26. Uh, 8,000 pounds is basically what we can scale. Phone number, y'all need to see that. Cut that out. <laughs> Lift gate, blankets, all that. Post it. Now the truck is posted. Next, we're gonna go to search for loads. 
We're gonna go to Jamaica. And why we're gonna put 150 mile dead here. We're gonna put no destination. Spe uh, specifics? Specifics? Specific. Straight box truck, 26 foot, 10,000 pounds, both full and partial. Um, we're gonna put a date for the 29th and then we're gonna hit search. After we hit search, a bunch of loads will pop up. We're actually gonna save, um, start a alarm and let DAT work for us when something new pops up. All right, as y'all can see, there's some kinetic kick to Cali for three eight. New Jersey to Cali for three five. Oh, that is PA to South Carolina for nine hundred. This is a double. Like it's a, it's the same thing out there twice. It's right here and right there. So you gotta pay attention to that. There's a New Jersey to NE, New Jersey to Georgia. We are actually trying to get across. Right, so, so I think I, I found a little interested, interested in, in from PA to Illinois. They said they factor it's a partial. So let's check them out. We're gonna check them out on RTS. So, so you're gonna, gonna take, take the MC, MC number one three one nine one two. And we're gonna put it in RTS. One three one nine one two. And they are a C, so that lets that lets us know that they factor with our company. So we'll go back to DAT. And we're gonna give them a call. All right, so we're gonna give them a call. Um, it is from PA to Illinois, 769 mile trip. Um, let's make sure that is right first. All right, so as you can see, it's 781 miles. 778 miles. All right, so there's a couple of things you wanna know before you just go calling people. All right, it's 781 miles. Uh, we wanna start at 210. So that's 16. We know that box trucks, and this is a partial two, so we know box trucks are not, it's gonna be hard for you to get over $2 a mile. But we're gonna start at 210, all right? Skates draw the beat, ayy. Come back when they answer. I'll check on that. Six one five one four. Yeah, that's the reference that's number. Right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Got it. Um, sir, the load is already covered just now. Thank you so much for calling about this. I really appreciate it. It's already covered, sir. Thank you. You're welcome. Mm -hmm. So just that quick. I'm telling y'all, man. I'm telling y'all. I'm telling y'all. Telling y'all, you gotta move fast. 
That was our chance to get to Illinois. All right, guys, be on the lookout for this one. It says little air mileage thing. Be on the lookout for that because that is not right. So let's check this. So it's actually 494 miles. 494 miles. Busy, busy, busy. <laughs> Booking a load can be intense, guys. Especially when you're not trying to drive long distances like fucking 2,000 miles. So when you actually set the bill notification, it tells you when a new match comes and all you got to do is hit refresh. So you're not sitting there hitting the same button over and over and over and over and over. So these are the two new ones that popped up zero minutes ago. Not available now. Please leave your name and phone number after the beep. How do y'all? They post stuff and then don't pick up the phone. Like, bro, we've been sitting here for almost. We've been sitting here for a whole hour now. We haven't even got in contact with anybody yet to even even quote us a price. And people don't answer their emails. That's another thing you got to deal with. We're trying to get to the Midwest, so we're not just taking anything. It would be a lot easier if we were just taking anything, but we're not just taking anything today. We're trying to do better. Nobody don't answer. We know freaking Total Quality will. Thank you for calling Total Quality Logistics. Your call may be recorded or monitored for quality assurance. If you're calling regarding a posting and have a post ID, press 8. If you know your party's extension, please dial it now. If you're a driver or a dispatcher, please press 1. Not yet, guys. I'm not there yet. Even total quality ain't gonna be. Your pick call up. is very important to us. Please hold the available team member. Thank you for our key email here program. <laughs> Thank you for your patience. A TQL representative will be with you in a moment. TJ seeming to be rough today. Ah. Did you know that TQL's technology... Hey, babe, this is Joe. How can I help you? Yeah, I'm calling by the Philadelphia, PA to uh, Chicago, Illinois. Hello, sorry to be covered. Sorry. Thank you. That's right, baby. That's that quick, y'all. 8 p.m. Thursday night. 8 p.m. Thursday night? Correct. What time Thursday night? 8 p.m. Oh, 8 p.m. Lord, well, forgive me. My bad. <laughs> <laughs> it's been a long morning, man. It's been a long morning. Uh, 8 p.m. Thursday night. So that's... Dang, that's three days. Um... I see you got it at one eight. Can we go uh, even two? Cause this. Uh,
thousand. If he says yes, I'll have to have a truck for him. Hold on, let me see, cause one yeah. six five two. Oh, uh, no, nah, we can't do 2000 All right. Yeah, no worries, man. He, I, know, I know I'm not going to get him any higher than that. Not yet, anyway. Not yet. Can you yeah. can you give me a call back? Because that's, uh, that's a lot of miles. Man, his lines blew up on this load. The rate's too low, but his lines blew up. I can't, I'm not going to call anybody back. He's just going to take it eventually for the lowest rate. Call me back if you can do 2000 because I can, I can probably get him to do that. No, nah, I can't. I he passed on 21 already? God, dog. <laughs> yep. All right. Yeah, well, it's, it's, he, he, he's trying to, his argument is that this one power, but my argument is that Yeah, they do, it doesn't he's change. The the bill, so. <laughs> yeah, that doesn't change the mileage. All right. Uh, he gets desperate, though. I'll put that more, more money in the posting. Just keep an eye on it. Okay. All right. Thanks. So y'all see, people cheat, man. They cheat. They think that just because it's one pilot that the miles, the miles don't add up. And then not that is that it got to stay on the truck until Thursday night. So that literally hinders me a whole nother day, that, which makes me lose less money. So. It makes me makes me lose less money. <laughs> <laughs>